Hello everyone, today I'm talking to Daisy who is 16 years old and we are going to talk about Daisy's time at school and the equipment she has used to help with her studies. Hello Daisy, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm well thank you. You recently completed year 11 of school, can you tell me a, bit, a little bit about what subjects you did and what was your favourite? I did... English or mathematics. Um, yeah, English was probably one of my favourites. ICT, science, geography, um, land-based studies, which are surprisingly good at, which is surprising. And yeah, they're pretty good in science as well. But one of my favourites was That's definitely English. Good. I enjoyed that one. Yeah. You spent some time boarding at Lampsfield Grand School. What was it like? What did you like about boarding? I liked how it had a homely environment and you and the friends that you make there. And yeah, that's good. And can you tell us about your Senka and Charles? She helped you at school. She, yeah, she massively helped me, um, especially with my laptop, if something went wrong or um, if it wasn't charging or something, or I didn't know how to use something, I could always go to her and she'd really help me out with it. And um, Mary as well, when I needed to download like new apps, it was really, she was very helpful and just a really nice person to talk to. That, that's nice, it's good you had that support. Can you tell me about the equipment you use to help with your learning? What equipment did you use most? I mostly use my laptop, especially in English, for writing and taking notes. I also use my reading pen sometimes um, when oh, I okay. need to read or learn hard words. Um, I have an iPad, but I didn't really take that to school. I kind of had that at home. Um, but definitely my laptop, 100%. And for those who don't know what um the, about the reader pen, can you tell us a bit more about it? So it's a pen, and you can either plug it into headphones or not. But you drag it along a word, and it either spells out the word, or, or you can go to the dictionary and it tells you the meaning, which is quite helpful. Yeah, or I can spell it out. That's for you. good. It's a very good tool to use. <laughs> yeah. What are the most useful apps that you used? Probably Word Q to help me with my spelling and I think Word helped me. I mostly use Word and PowerPoint, especially during COVID. That was a lifesaver. So definitely Word yeah. Q, especially with my spelling. It's horrific, literally. <laughs> um, what, what, um, what's your favourite hobbies? I... I have a few hobbies. Well, I play the bass sometimes. I'm, I'm trying to learn the bass. Um, I like watching new things. I like swimming. I like, I love autumn. I love going for walks during the autumn. <laughs> That's pop love autumn. One of the best seasons, personally, by far. And I like hanging out with friends. And yeah, I'm buying little knickknacks from like charity shops. That's fun. <laughs> you enjoy you enjoy photography. What what do you like about taking f photographs? I like of? I like how it kind of captures the moment, and they have different fonts yeah. of it. Yeah. That's good. Um, you are about to go to the moat school for year 12 and 13. Are you excited about going there? I am very excited about going there. Very excited. And you recently went for t teaser sessions at the moat school. What did you do there? How was it like? It was really good. Um, I think I did performing arts. Um, that went a bit slow, but I did movie media. That was really good. And I did um, this comic thing, I forgot what it was called. 
began with an R, so something comics and photography. Yeah. And uh, what what would you like to complete when you what would you like to do once you complete school? What kind of jobs do you think you'd be interested in? Probably working in a shop, like maybe a record shop or somewhere. Um, okay. Maybe a florist. Um, but I'd definitely like to maybe start a band or something. Yeah. But that'd be nice. That'd be, yeah. Maybe get All right. Place. Well, thank you, Dave. Thank you, Daisy, for taking the time to interview, letting me interview you. Well, thank you for and having me. Cease. Thank you. And um, it's. I hope you enjoyed the remote school. Sounds really nice. Thank you. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs>